There are so many things that I've learned from Grant McEwen. Um, just the confidence overall um, to go into any venue in any place in the world, to step in and to, to be able to have that confidence when you're performing or when you're talking to other musicians is just unbelievable. Um, the technical aspect of it, vocally and theoretically, um, other instruments as well, it just really opens so many doors for me. We have about six or seven uh, ensemble rooms. Some of them serve double duty with lecture in the morning, ensemble classes in the afternoon. Some rooms are special purpose, recording studios, technology labs, drum percussion labs, the piano lab that I'm sitting in right now. The ability to book these rooms for practice for various ensemble practices when there are not classes happening. We also have uh, various guest lecturers and various artists that will come into some of these different classrooms and talk about various uh, parts of, their, of the performance for those, uh, those disciplines. But one of the things that really sets our program apart is the integration of technology within that. Everything from our songwriters that come in with the, the traditional acoustic guitar, singer, songwriter, folky type of image, we teach them how to use very basic software to say, put a microphone here or a microphone in front of their mouth, hit record and record their ideas. It gives the tools to everybody, whether it's full-fledged 24-track um, recording students uh, up to singer-songwriters. It's really just giving them the tools that they need to do that. So it's something that is unique to our program and to the best of my knowledge, not many schools in North America are doing it this way. I primarily try to teach the software tools to record the musical ideas. I'm not teaching logic or I'm not teaching reason uh, per se. I'm actually teaching those software so that they can capture the ideas. It's all about the creativity, about creating your own music. One aspect of our program that's a bit unique to other recording programs in the country is that everybody has to successfully complete the first year of music studies as a music student. They continue on their music studies while they're in school in the second year, even in this class. So the big difference is that we encourage and we uh, coax musician, um, engineers to be musicians first. There are many recording schools in the country that will gladly take your money, but you can be a welder by day and then take a recording class at night. We believe that it's most important to have the musical background to be able to be a musician, to speak the language, both from a, mu from a production standpoint as well as to communicate with musicians. So that's a really big difference in our program is that it's, it's part of the music program first. It's a means to record ideas, musical creativity, so it's just a part of the creative process. I really enjoy how at Grant McEwen, the faculty, they're all performers. They all are still very active in the music industry, and so they have lots of knowledge on performance and connections, and I think it's really good for our students to be able to connect with them on that level. It's not just them teaching us, but they actually know, you know, what it is firsthand to, to do music. You get the opportunity to study here with so many different people who are all brilliant and all very different, and they all offer you something different to consider or maybe to that to spark your interest in. You can feel it all you can they are all phenomenal, phenomenal musicians. Uh, all working musicians, which is really important so they can give you uh, an in-depth uh, look into the music scene in Edmonton today. Uh, and they're all willing to be your friend as well as your educator. They give you little hints and they sort of keep you going when you're having a rough time. A lot of times I see the faculty just jamming uh, or rehearsing with them by themselves in rooms, so you get to observe that if you want. And the faculty are all gigging musicians, so you can go out uh, into Edmonton and see them play as often as you like. There's been several times where I've gone out to see the faculty play and they've done something, a substitution or a particular tune that I would like to work on so I can actually go and talk to them one-on-one -on -one and be very specific and say, what did you do here and how do I do that? The blend of music at McEwen gives you a lot of options. You can play what you want, when you want, and it gives you a chance to diversify. And in today's music scene, diversity in your playing is a necessity. 
you meet people when you first come into the program and you get the chance to grow with them musically and you you know music isn't a solitary pursuit it's something that you do together and it's really hard sometimes to meet people that you click with musically especially in a pop or rock context um, I come from a classical background and so the the chance to make that shift into pop and rock music has been really exciting for me having jazz and pop and rock incorporated into the into my experience at McEwen was crucial because I think there were a lot of things about both of them that that I didn't know I loved you know I think sometimes you enter into an environment like this with a comfort zone and, and an idea of uh, a, pre a preconceived notion of who you are and through d through studying all different kinds of music you really develop a love for everything and everything has an ability to influence you creatively and I mean as a performer or a writer whatever you come out of here being and it, it all of them are equally important I think for sure. My biggest mistake was loving you too much. McEwen helped my career in an enormous way. Um, it really gives you the ability to be versatile. It, there's, it offers so much in terms of professionalism and in terms of exploring different genres of music. You know, you discover strengths where you didn't know you had them. I mean, I'm now a teacher, you know, I teach voice and, and I work with people on helping them learn to love music. Uh, you know, you, you build proficiency in a lot of other aspects as well. I mean, arranging. As a singer, you focus a lot on um, piano proficiency. I mean, we all did. So I've, it's, it's given me so many opportunities to, to make music and make a living.